doing maintenance on the plane, he's doing maintenance on me. Straps are good. Go, go. That's are good. Go, go. Okay. We're good to go, guys. up at the range. I uh, didn't know we were staying below 50 feet or staying around 50 feet. And he said, well, if you guys are going to stay at 50 feet, then All right, we range, can uh, fly early. Range so, procedures checklist. Brian's going to give the range brief. Either way, the timer is 45 seconds, has to touch the shoulder. Yep. That's our safety. Safety has to come down, come down no yep. matter what. Yep. So even if we haven't hit all the conditions, we come down. Yep. All right, sweet. All right, I think we're good. Let's get the uh, pre-flight and ground checks done. Flies like a real airplane. Yep. Oh, it's perspective. <laughs> Clear prop. Uh, Wrong way. Yeah. Uh, Hold on. It could be because it's connected. That's true. It could be. Oh, it's it's the bottom piece. Is it? The, the, yeah. I think, yeah, so. Do you have an Alan piece? Yeah. yeah, it's loose. Okay. Joe, do you have Loctite? I do, I do not. Don't have Loctite. Dude, these planes are held together with Loctite and prayers. We have the prayers. We need the Loctite. Well, <laughs> add it to the list. Yeah, you want to add to the list after we missed our flight test window. We have three hundred thousand dollars in airspace. It's it's eight thirteen. We're doing. I no, mean, we're yeah. not, dude. If A ten's coming in forty five minutes. Motor's fine. Next altitude outdoor. Hold five and ten foot AGL. Five seconds on condition and land. Five second timer. Left shoulder. Clear flight test. Power, power test, clear front. Safe to approach We have power. Flight test card five complete. Test card six is do we have control? Uh, approach aircraft, it's, let's get the power it's off. It's just too much wind. It's like 10 knots. So it, rather than try to push the control envelope, I just let the wind take it. Sure. Yeah, right down. Control envelope for test six. We're pretty good for what, sideways. What is the wind? Yeah, oh. it just exceeds, I mean, it exceeds the five five miles an hour that we wanted. Oh, Brian, what keeps us from doing it for now? I know, I know range, I know range here, but we've already cleared it under 50 feet. No, I, uh, that's a, for safety mitigation, we have options. We need to get, uh... Can we move it to tonight? Because it's calm every night. I know, it's perfect. Five. We do it at Northbound tonight. I don't know. We gotta find out. 
The value of Tiber 2 is that it's endearing. It has it has a lot of it's like your it's like a it's like how a mother loves its child with all of its flaws and faults. The fact that it doesn't do jack if it's going more than five miles an hour. That's the value of Tiber 2. It's endearing. Mark II will actually do stuff. It was a pathway to Mark II. It was a pathway to Mark II. I don't want to destroy it trying to pit it against conditions that Mark II can. So yeah, the final day of testing was actually, there's was, there was a lot in those like last 48 hours that we were planning to be up at Grayling. Um, and kind of, I think the time of our, our demonstration shifted quite a few times. We were like, hey, when's it actually going to be ready to go versus when are people available? And, and like a pre-demonstration sort of became the demonstration. So that shifted for a while until what we landed on was in that day, we made a call. We we're like, okay, so these key people are coming here anyway today. We're pretty much good to go, minus a couple things. If we just full send this and just have it at five o'clock, we just do the whole demonstration instead of tomorrow morning, then we could actually close up at the end of today. Um, and everyone was ready to like, get the win and close up and go. We're gonna have barbecue with the MG in Myers and fly from the sim here and fly from the sim at the cottage. Brian's going to the cottage to run the controls from the cottage to do a test. Um, Ty is yelling maybe on all of us. Maybe. Well. Particularly if it's tonight uh, and we don't have time to like thoroughly test the control transfer. Yeah, it's the first thing getting vetoed. Yeah. How are you feeling, Ty? What's here? Oh. Pressure is the mother of all innovation. And today, something that has never flown before, it's flown from a VR system never tested before, and it's worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. And hopefully it's not my ship that breaks. Stop, and then clap once. I'd probably be worse. Uh, My fiance does most of the folding. Mm. Uh, yeah. Everything's always up in the air. The last minute, but I'm looking for a HDMI cable and power cables for the TVs and they are not here. So we got the demonstration in a couple hours. Yes, we do. So first you gotta prove the airplane. I know, which do is it. what we need to do right now. You got, so, you got enough batteries to do that? Yeah. All right, well it's light, it's light enough right now for Mark II. We still wanna make sure that the tilt mechs don't oscillate. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think both of them need a freaking dry run. Because every time there's a dry run, we got to fix some shit. Yep. So I would do a control sweep. I'm just, if we start doing this, I have to pull Tosh. And he really needs to talk. Well. All right. So what's the deal? I hate my job. <laughs> that makes zero sense. <laughs> All right, clear prop. Both aircraft are going to compete tonight. Test cards one through eight. The first, uh, we're the first company approved. First company to design, manufacture, build, and fly an aircraft in Michigan to be flight test approved by the Air Force. Yeah. So this is a huge deal for Hold on, let me start by the call. Alright, let's just fix it.
That could be a dust thing on that yeah, one. I think it's a dust thing. We uh, lit. Cap? We lit a little I, bit. I, I caught that. Yeah. Uh, we that. blew. Uh, we blew a whole bunch of stuff on this guy. You get a replacement. Yeah. Cool. Sorry. So you guys are locking the meatball. Yeah. What? Yeah. Ah, that's exactly like just now. Yeah, and then we kicked up a bunch of dust yeah. and got a, some bit of lead up there in the right tail, and you can see it blow up. All right, let's get back to it. Test card six. I'm going to call test, five, test card five a pass. Okay. I just can't. If it's, is it low enough latency to fly? All right. We have one, basically we have 15 minutes or one test to rejig. Yeah, I have no idea what's going on. He just wants to make me move. Do you guys need me to just fly the next test card? Yeah, yeah let's do it. Yeah. I did, 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 did. We're going to go line of right now. All right, this is flight test card six. Max altitude 10 feet, outdoor, low hover. Smooth application of power, five to 10 feet. Hold, 15 seconds. Then one quarter control, stick reflection, left, right, forward, back. Yaw, followed by half control. Forward, back, left, right, yaw. Then zero off ground speed and recover. Any questions? No problem. You are cleared. Flight test six. They're brought. millimeter in each direction. <laughs> what was? To, like, uh, the control? If it a millimeter left, it did the amount of control. So it's extremely, extremely expensive. All right. Until we, until for the safety of the people around me, six. Lord of the West. Lord of the West works. Win go. Win. Another 50 meters beyond the power line and do test carding. Ty, Ty, come on. Look at the lady. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Ty DeLargy. <laughs> made Orbo S happen.
happen in four weeks. One month, so congratulations. Woo! Okay, well let's go get let's go get Mark one and let's give it a college try on uh, <coughs> on and a tape measure and a spray paint circle, ten feet. There you go. Right. Uh, the attempt will be. Oh, look, it didn't work. <laughs> oh. Oh, I can't. Golf class? Very nice. <laughs> Thank you. I always do play. Oh, okay. Yeah, it is a pretty cool sign. Yeah, yeah. You're pretty cool, Thad. Cool. No. <laughs> <laughs> is it that? You tell me. All right, I'm gonna pop it. I'm gonna pop it off faster this time. Okay. Third flight test, number six. Yep. Test card six. Yep. Hey, we pushed her. We pushed her absolutely to the limit. Okay. All right. This concludes. This concludes T bird two. Good job, team. Take her back inside. Nice. All right. For, uh, we need no to learn limit, limit. I remember I was going to limit it, and I was like, we're full set on the setting. Is so, just, celebrating. Uh, so, so I, I we that's it. have no, a they're all, appointment at the cabin. It's all off. Okay. Um, I need to stop working. So, so, we started flying without the VR headset, and then I sort of begged everybody, went around to Thad, and everything was like, do we have enough battery for one more flight? One more test, please. Then Alex was like, all right, I trust you, we, we can do it. So he threw on the VR headset. Uh, we kind of got things sized and calibrated the way he wanted them for his kind of screen and everything. Um, and then we flew it in beyond. Yeah, I think, yeah, I've just been really impressed with the whole team and, and all of the people, really. Everyone here is technically competent in what they do, but also everyone's just really good people yeah. and easy to be around, so, um, yeah, it'd be a very different story if it wasn't for the people that work here. Everybody was Chase them back. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, get him! Ah! 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 Ah!